Sports. I'm Jamie Lindrohan, and you are watching Comcast Newsmakers. We're coming to you from the Newark, New Jersey site of the New Jersey Performing Arts Center. And remember, keep your eyes peeled because the bus could be pulling into a station near you. We're coming to you from the Crystal Tea Room in the Wanamaker Building in Philadelphia. We're here in Jersey City, New Jersey, home of the Hudson County Boys and Girls Club. I'm Jamie Lindrohan. From John Bon Jovi to Shaquille O'Neal. Hello and thanks for joining us. I'm Jamie Lindrohan. 07090 starts right now. Thanks for joining us. I'm Jamie Lindrohan and you're watching a special red carpet edition of Comcast Cable. New York actor Vincent Pastore is even considering making a move across the river. In fact, my account and says, Vinny, you should move to New Jersey. You should. I am looking for property in Point Pleasant. You say anything, call me up tomorrow. Former New York Knicks player and United States Senator Bill Bradley continues to score points off the court, and when asked how he'd rate the honor he was receiving from the New Jersey Hall of Fame, he said... Swish. <laughs> Love it. That's like the best soundbite ever. Such a good time. From rock legends to powerhouse athletes, the stars will continue to shine throughout the Garden State. And as far as this Jersey girl is concerned, if you can't be them, well, you'll just have to join them here at the New Jersey Hall of Fame. Whether it's a brisk walk in the park or a 5K run right here in downtown Westfield, the Westfield Running Company has everything you need to meet your fitness goals. Whether you're in the market for training wheels or a 10-speed, J-Cycle Shop has been here in downtown Westfield for the past 50 years, and they're sure to have something for everyone. Um, I even noticed they were working on a little mini fire fire engine. I think it was for yes. possibly like a toddler. It's, I, I'd have to say so. Yeah, you yeah. never know what you're going to see Hopefully here. Hopefully it's for a toddler. It's, yeah, it's for a toddler. No, it's actually, actually my ride. <laughs> Whether it's lunch, dinner, or just a quick bite, Chocolat is sure to hit the spot. We'll find out what's the latest from Town Hall, take a run downtown with Councilwoman Joanne Nealon, and go behind the scenes of the Emmy Award winning TV show It's Your Call with Lynn Doyle. A multi-award winning journalist and nine-time Emmy Emmy recipient with more than 25 years of television news experience. She is host and executive producer for the Comcast Network's Emmy award-winning TV show, It's Your Call with Lynn Doyle. My mother was probably my greatest role model because when I was um, a young girl, she had a career at a time when women typically didn't have careers. City Year unites young people from all backgrounds for a year of full-time service, giving them the skills and opportunities to change the world. By no means your average Joe, Philadelphia Eagles President Joe Banner was on hand to accept City Year's Lifetime of Idealism Award. How has City Year changed you? Well, I mean, I think anybody who's had anything to do with City Year develops a perspective on, you know, first from my perspective, how lucky I am. So tell me, are you ready to give a year and change the world? City Year aims to inspire and support citizen service, uniting people around the globe. And you, my friends, are no exception. So how do you get started? Very simply, check out our gallery of compelling VO tagged media and click on the button at the bottom of the screen for more information or pick up the phone and contact us at our offices right here in the heart of Times Square. I'm Jamie Lynn Rohan. thanks for joining me. My next guest wants you to know it's not too late to receive your stimulus payments, you just need to file. Hello and thank you for joining us. I'm Jamie Lynn Rohan, and you, my friend, are watching Comcast Newsmakers. This hour's newsmaker is IRS Media Relations Specialist David Stewart, and today we're talking about the economic stimulus payment. This hour's newsmaker is Pennsylvania State Representative Ron Waters, and today we're talking about the annual Family Reunion All Day Festival here in Philadelphia. Thanks for joining us. Thank you so much for having me. Well, talk to our viewers at home about why this reunion is so important. Why should they get involved? We're coming to you from the Visitor Center here in Philadelphia, here today to celebrate the Lincoln 200. The sculpture is being presented to the city of Philadelphia in honor of Abraham Lincoln's 200th birthday and to honor the 30th anniversary of diplomatic relations between the United States and China. Lincoln recognized how important Philadelphia was to uh, the Civil War, but also uh, to uh, the fundamental principles of what uh, this nation is all about, and it all happened right here. In the nearly 150 years since his death, Lincoln has become all things to all people, and the goal of the Lincoln 200 exhibition is to explore the man as he was seen in his time. You've been watching Comcast on the red carpet, a special presentation of Comcast Local Edition. The wheels on the bus go round and round, and the same goes for C-SPAN's campaign bus tour 2008. Hello and thanks for joining us for this special presentation of Comcast Cable on the road with C-SPAN campaign 2008. And what exactly does 
as Senator Bob Menendez hopes students will learn from the C-SPAN campaign bus. Out of the mouth of babes come some good ideas. That concludes the special presentation of Comcast Cable on the road with C-SPAN campaign 2008. I'm Jamie Lindroham. I'm Jamie Lindroham. I'm Jamie Lindroham. And I'll see you on the red carpet. And as always, thanks for watching. <laughs>